Welcome back to your turn to die. After a bit of a break, it's time to delve into Chapter 2, Part 2. Hey, how you doing? I'm going to take you on a stroll down memory lane. Recap the story so far. Be grateful, you bastard. Of course, if you're thinking thanks, but no thanks, you're free to leave, okay? Interestingly, we have to hear it. And in this case, when you go into it from the title screen, there's... I imagine the reason we have to hear it before starting the game is going to come up. I'm not sure how it's going to come up, but it's going to come up. Right, get down on your knees and listen. <sighs> These guys are Sarah Chinoin and her best friend Joe Tazuna. They're a pair of dweebs who waltz together into the death game, all friendly like... Without having a clue what was what, their first trial began. They clear lots more. And they chose to cooperate and survive with all the other participants. But the cooperation was for naught, and high school teacher Kazumi Mishima died. His ex-student, now Egokuro, went into this hilarious panic over it, see? So the self-described homemaker, Kai Sato, made use of that to instigate her. And she stole back the laptop that job hopper so he already got his hands on. The laptop concealed proof that Kai was colluding with the organization. Ultimately, Kai died in the main game. All because he grabbed the Sage card. And Joe, too, he got the Sacrifice card, and died. Seems hallucinations started to eat away at Sarah. The second stage was the sub-game, where everybody traded tokens amongst themselves. During all that, an AI of the dead Mishima showed up. And so did a fake doll that looked just like Reiko. It was one huge calamity. And all amid all that, Kutaro Burgerberg discovered that laptop again. He was nearing the heart of the death game, but... Lured by tokens, he handed the laptop over to So. Man, ain't double-crossing just the best? Kutaro gathered the most tokens, and Ginbushi didn't collect squat. I was looking forward to one of them dying, but... Okay, hotshot pop quiz. Ah, oh, this has got to be it, isn't it? Which of these two was the one that actually died? Oh, we get to actually select them. So who died, Reiko or Alice? Well, we're going to save Reiko. So, I'm so sorry, Alice. Did Alice Yabasami die? Correct the mundo. Good for you. It was Alice Yabasami who died in the end. Caught by my lies, in fact. Man, you guys are seriously stupid. Having feelings when you're killing each other. It'll only hurt you, you know. What I didn't know is that I'd be killed, too. But I... I should have been Dad's masterpiece. Now, everyone. If your memories are all in order, allow me to invite you once again the main game. It was debate on whether or not this guy is actually a human, but that tilt of the head feels really unnatural. Eight remain. Hey, you know what a majority vote is? Kai? One vote. Kai? Another vote. Oh. This is Kai getting voted. Huh? You didn't know they'd die? <laughs> hey, long time no see. Well, gotten used to majority votes yet? Shut up. <laughs> Are you mad? Well, keep it up and vote for who you hate. Kill decisively so you can survive. Kill the people who get in your way. No big, no big. It's not like it's your fault. Aren't I right? So he... Whoa, whoa, huh? 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 Your countenance has really changed. <laughs> Funny. Do your best. What is this? So? 
ready to tear these all off and throw them out. Whoa, 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 what the hell? What is going on down here? <laughs> Need to dispose of all the documents in the shredder. This, oh, this is the room in the... What are we doing? So gloomy. What do we do? This this was definitely a room that we were once in. The paper shredder that Gin was piecing the other papers in. What? Yeah. Uh, that, just don't mind the eyeballs of the paper shredder filled with blood. Don't mind them. Ah, uh, move, run. Oh, what? I'm collapsed on the floor. You okay, bro? An important laptop. This. Remember, it's Kai's laptop that I found on the first floor. What? It's gone. It was stolen. By Miss Now, when she... What, 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 what the hell? I'm dead. What? I see. That time Miss Now attacked me. Every mating trace. All of it. What? I'm dead. Uh, uh, that, that, that. What is going? Okay, run. Bye. What? What is that? What? What's this? Obtained a frying pan. <laughs> so gloomy. Dead men tell more tales, right, Kai? What is going on? Run. How far are you going to run? Run? Me? No one needs you. Why do you live? I'm astonished by everyone just refusing to ever doubt that you're right. Isn't this enough? Here, I'll kill you. Wait, that's a Sarah outline. <laughs> sure enough, that's your true nature. Uh, it's your turn to die. So? <laughs> Sarah! <gasps> so! Please wake up! Oh. Kana. This is my room. Don't startle me all of a sudden. You're all I have left, so? Please, don't suddenly collapse. Sorry? Sorry. Just relax. If you're obedient, I'll tell you how to survive. What? What is- why are we going through this again? Kana. Don't you betray me. Okay. Well then, let's start a strategy meeting. What? You too, Kutaro. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> this is getting to be fun. Hey, is playing an instrument fun? What? <gasps> what? You interested, bro? Watching you makes me want to play, Reiko. You're too clumsy, bro. Don't you even can. <laughs> oh, mean. <laughs> Don't whine about it. Alright, I'll teach you. You mean it? If you get bored of it, I'll kick your butt. Of course I won't get bored. <laughs> hey, Reiko. <laughs> What's up? Someday, let's make a band and have our debut. Uh, for real? I'll make songs and you sing them. Doesn't that sound wonderful? <laughs> Sounds great. Don't forget it, bro. Oh, Don't you ever forget. Reiko has just been staring at the unmoving Alice, not even noticing me behind her. You dumbass! You broke another promise! No, maybe I broke it. Saying like, what would you know? I wouldn't even face you. Was I the mistaken one? Maybe you're not talking with me. Maybe even you going and killing a guy. It was all my fault. It's my fault. It was all my fault. 
Just come back to life. Damn it. Shit! I had so many chances to forgive you. What can I say? Reiko. You guys. Um, I know how you feel. But the main game will be very soon. Just leave me alone, damn it! Uh, Reiko! Uh, we were told to assemble, right? I know that. If I see one of those kidnappers' faces right now, I know my fists are gonna fly. Y you can't do that. We can't lose you too, Reiko. Right? So please, just leave me alone now. Uh, I understand. Now. What should I do? Force Reiko to come along. I mean, I... She really needs some time right now? What's all these call her? If you don't persuade with Reiko with now... Well, oh, wait. No, that was bad. W wait, now! Yes? Uh, never mind. For just a little bit. Stay at my side. Uh, Reiko! Um, Sarah? Yeah. Please, leave this to me. I can't support everyone like you, Sarah. But I think I can support Reiko right now. Uh, understood. I'll be right there. I'm sure Reiko will get back on her feet. Good girl. I'll trust now. Off to the medical office. Leave this to me, Sarah. Now's looking very dependable. Yes, she is. I'm proud of you now. I... Reiko... Alice lies in the center of the room of lies. There's a huge hole in his stomach. Hello, Ranger. They had a real Ranger. He was a doll, just like the fake Reiko. Joe's hair clip remains in his hair. Take it. Get back. This is Joe's. Obtain Joe's hair clip. Ranger has no objection. The torso of Rio Ranger. Because of Ranger, Alice and the fake Reiko both. Alright. Oh, these are all of my spare files. I think at this point I can just boop back up to the top. Suspicious vending machine. What do we have here? Oh, we have this. Bruce listing the participants in the death game. There are only 16 names here. We still have the highest percentage here. There's still a lot of names we don't have. We don't know, rather. Shunsuke Hayasa. Yeah, there's a lot of them. Anzu Kanashi. Oh, okay. Sarah Chiruin. Keiji Shinogi. Kutaro BB. Ah, oh, there's a lot of interesting people we never met. Alice, murderer. Ah, that's, that's a shame. Kazumi Mishima. This has to be the, the one we saw with the uh, Keiji in the video. And Mario Kaki. There's a lot of high school students. Kanakazuchi. Kenabushi. Shinzumiki. Tsukimi. Where is this gonna play into things? I'll go to the medical office. Everyone should be waiting there. Hello. Keiji? Big Sis Sarah! Gin, you're up and moving already? Yeah! I'm totally better, Wolf. Poison won't scare me anymore, meow. Guess the antidote Keiji brought worked like a charm. Don't see no weird after effects neither. Good showing from your friendly policeman, eh? It really was a close call. If Keiji hadn't found the antidote, Gin might have... Keiji. Thank you very much. Same to you. Your reasoning saved us, Sarah. Not to mention your decisiveness in that moment. You and now really are something. I allowed the fake Reiko to die. And also, even Alice. Look at me, Sarah. We've lost a lot of allies on the way here. Alice, he may have looked like trouble at first, but I don't think he was a bad guy. 
think he legitimately wanted to make up with his sister. Let's see, Sarah. You've got the lives you saved right here. Isn't that right? <laughs> Our salvation. Gin's smile is helping to save us all. Yes, the true hero. If we lost him too, I'm sure we'd... The true hero. The absolute angel. Gin! Thank goodness, you've gotten all better. Take this now. Rago? Ah, big sis Rago? That is... I I'm glad, Gin. Rago gently stroked Gin's head. <laughs> yeah. Big sis Rako, I... <laughs> what are you crying for? You're a big kid. Sorry, Meow. I couldn't do anything. So, Alice... Ain't nothing for you to apologize about, Gin. But... They sure scared you, huh, Gin? Sigh, the real me couldn't be there when you were in a pinch. Just noticing not only her expression, but... Her eye makeup. She's definitely been crying. No, big sis Rico. So all of you have assembled. Hello. I will now begin explanations for the second main game. Gashu. Mr. Ginabushi, how are you fair? There he is, meow. Uncle Crabstash. Uncle Crabstash. I think we're just gonna sit here and listen to your damn explanation. You guys are always pulling tricks. I won't trust you, Wolf. Hmm. What the heck? Woof! Don't come any closer, meow! Fantastic. Meow? Yeah? Just amazing, Mr. Ginabushi. Abs stunning resilience! Why, you're the picture of health already! And Uncle Crabstash, it is an honor to receive such a charming nickname. You screwed with us now? Fantastic! Simply fantastic! <laughs> it's, your it's your subtitle now! I, I feel sick, meow! Oh dear. So there is yet some venom left. Hey, stop that, Wolf! Um, when you get into the explanation... So obviously, the so... Kana... and... Kutaro strategy meeting happened... before... in the interim somewhere. Pardon me. Well then, I shall explain this main game. That said, the basic rules are the same. It is a voting game making use of four cards. The Keymaster, Sage, Sacrifice, and Commoner. The Keymaster is the key man of destruction should they be chosen. The one who carries it bears great responsibility, but it also serves as armor. The Sage is a superhuman who knows the one in possession of the Keymaster role. But once exposed, it is hard to protect oneself. The sacrifice will die unless chosen. They are the sole person who can turn defeat into victory, or victory into defeat. And the commoners have no power at all, but thus they fill the role of guiding the discussion in the proper direction. However, this time we will use data in place of paper cards. D data Card data has already been distributed at random to the voting tab that you possess. All that remains is the permission to access it. Why'd you have to make it so roundabout? Very sharp indeed, Mr. Qtara. Because this time, you are able to make trades. And forcibly at that. We can trade our cards. Indeed. Now then, let me show you. Come forth, ring up box. What? A, a phone booth came from the floor. We may trade cards by making a request at one of these ring-up boxes situated in each room. They are simple to use. Simply insert 50 tokens and grab the receiver. F 50 tokens? Of course, just like the sub-game, you cannot use your own tokens. What a ridiculous rule! Well, Kyutaro's gonna be making trades all fucking day. He's got all the tokens. Oh, I thought... I had thought you would be delighted, Mr. Kyutaro. <laughs> It's an awful rule. People without tokens don't even get the right to trade. Trades are one-on-one -on -one with whom you select. Please trade freely, with whomever you wish. You have a time limit of approximately three hours. When all have returned to their bedrooms, that will signal the start of this trading phase. Uh, uh. 
Do not wear such gloomy looks, everyone. Win and survive, for you were all born to win. What is he talking about? So then please return to your rooms within five minutes. If you do not, you understand, you know. I don't like that head tilt. It feels so unnatural. The atmosphere is unpleasant. We look at each other's faces and try to judge how we're feeling. What should I say? We'll definitely escape. We'll escape for sure. Sarah! It's not like we're out of time. There must be something we can do. I might sound flimsy, but I'm not giving up. You said it, Sarah! I mean, it ain't like everything's going hunky-dory for them, neither. The guy with a stash shooting ranger must have been unexpected too, right? Huh? Wh what? You said something weird? No, you're exactly right. Unexpected. If you look for things our enemy didn't expect, there's sure to be a way out of this. Then I'll head back first. Don't want to get killed for being tardy. You do that, so... Let's get going, guys. Rain box is set up here. Trade cards with whoever you want for 50 tokens, huh? I mean, I don't have any tokens currently. I had some tokens for... Everyone's heading off to their bedrooms. Dancing at each other's faces, seeing looks of anxiety mixed with trust. Big Sis Sarah! Hmm? What is it? What is it, Gin? I hate it because the suspicious loner was there. I might have found a way out, Woof! Uh, huh? I don't want to trouble you guys anymore, Meow. So I'll do my best, Woof! Ah, Gin! I feel so uneasy. Is everything going to be okay? Where are we... Uh, what? Gin? I mean, I guess we'll go back. Oh, whew. A ring of box has appeared in the back of my room. Huh. It's quiet. You're in my room. I'm all alone. Huh? My hands are shaking. This. Back there, I tried to cheer everyone up so they wouldn't be uneasy. I told myself I couldn't give in around them. When I'm alone, I'm so cowardly. No, no, I can't get timid. What? 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 What is that? What the? Suddenly the tablet began making sound. What could this sound mean? It's begun. What do you got? What's our card? A trading phase of the main game will now begin. Now accessing your roll card. My roll! A fateful moment. <sighs> the key master is a good card to have from a meta standpoint as the protagonist. So I'm curious what we're going to end up with. I have a feeling we're not going to get Keymaster twice in a row. My heartbeat is loud and out of control. Subconsciously, I was praying. Don't do it. Anything but the one that killed Joe. Oh. Commoner. I see. Ah. Before I knew it, I dropped to the floor. Relief. I stayed there motionless for a few minutes. There's still time for someone to fucking trade with us. Force trade with us. Thank God. Hey, Sarah. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> is that now? Uh, um, is that you now? Does my voice sound that cute? No, but it's your friendly policeman. KG! Should I open the door and invite him in? Ask him for a password. If you're KG, you should know the password. Tell it to me. Now that's a toughie. Yes, this case is going unsolved. Only imagine KG giving such an unmotivated reply. Okie dokie. I'll just, I'll just get straight to business. Business? Sarah, you're... The sacrifice, right? What? <laughs> That's one obvious reaction, Sarah. Sh shoot! I made a weird sound! Ah, thank goodness. If you really were the sacrifice, I'd have been pretty worried. I, I haven't confirmed anything yet! Make it obvious, but you won't confess. Sure enough, you're clever. But you're still a bad liar. <laughs> well, I'm the key master.
Yeah. Not gonna trust me in my word, are you? Just hold on a sec, Sarah. I hear footsteps trailing away from my door. What's he going to do? Oh, is he going to force trade me the Keymaster card? Huh? The tablet again! You have been traded. Oh, fuck! <laughs> my role changed! The first trade has just been performed. A trade? Well, I traded you my Keymaster. What? What? Practically on reflex, I opened my door. Thanks. So, Sarah, you were a commoner. What were you thinking? Uh. I dragged him into the room and closed the door. Whoa! That was a valuable chance for a trade. Why did you go and waste it on this? Huh? You're mad at me. I'm not mad. Just wanted you to trust me. Well, I've only got three hours. No time to waste suspecting each other over rules. Because we're going to make our escape. I understand. You must have an idea. Tell it to me. Right. Say, Sarah, what sort of methods could we escape by, you think? Methods? Destroy the death game. I kind of dig this. We could cause a stir to the point that they're like, the death game is neither here nor there. Hmm. Then what? Should we make a time bomb? Yes, please. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Sure enough, the thing we need is information. Where is this place? What sort of building is it? If you set a floor map, at least, we'd have half a chance. A floor map? Who among us would know something like that? Aha! Uh, huh. Wait, is there someone? Mishima Kai... Kai? Kai, of course! Exactly. Way to go, Sarah. Kai was connected with the baddies. Even if he didn't know the details of the death game, he might have known something about this facility. But Kai's gone now, but with his laptop... So then, the laptop you left behind. Yep, there's still info we haven't checked on that laptop. Kitaro got his hands on it once, but it ran out of battery. And now it's back in So's hands. It'll be hard to get back. And that brings us to... You remember the place we found it? That room full of rubble. Why oh, did a little detectiving there? You got a sec, Sarah? W what is it? Keiji whispered in my ear. Kai came to that room. <laughs> what? Now let's move. There's no time. <laughs> uh, hold on, Keiji. Kai was in that room? But before you even came to the third floor, Kai was already... Oh boy, things are getting spicy already. I like it. Now? Is that now? Sarah! What's the matter? Sarah? Uh, oh, I just figured I shouldn't be sitting still. Now? I thought I should be thinking about a way for us to escape, too. I'll tell you right away if I find anything, Sarah. Strange. Huh? Maybe I'll lend you my aid, Sarah. Your aid? What? <laughs> you could now use Keiji's partner ability. Oh, my partner Pokemon. <laughs> my detective site. It should be at least a, a little useful. Let's see that icon to activate your partner's ability. Oh! I choose you, KG. What? I'll take right away if I find anything, Sarah. What? What? Are you nervous about something? Um, is something wrong? Nah, it's nothing. Uh, I'll be going then. What was that sensation? Hmm? Did you just see something too, Sarah? Huh? <laughs> he had the same eyes as me. The eyes of a shrewd detective who never overlooks the heart's unrest. You sense something shady about now. Must be the result of spending days with her. You mean now is hiding something? Dunno. Unfortunately, we don't exactly have the time to confirm that right now. 
Let's do what we have to. There's only ever one option to take. Now. So the room of rubble is past the ruined corridor. Let's go. It's now out to make a trade. We can go everywhere right now. Yutaro's here. Yutaro is sitting silently. Now what am I gonna do? Looks like he's breathing a little easily. Scare him from behind. Boom! Whoa! Are you looking for leads on escape, Yutaro? Don't casually switch over to conversation. You freak me out. I'm looking, but sure enough, nothing new. Guys, that dumb. That's pretty much all I got. It'd be nice to persuade so, but he ain't leaving his room. Kana's with him too. Hope he's done. Hope we don't use her for nothing evil. I really hope Detective Eyes I sense impatience from Utara. Maybe the reason he's not entirely at wit's end because he's got lots of tokens, so he can make a trade. I like that. His detective eyes. They're just neat. I dig it. So now he's acting weird. Reiko? Feel a strength and a sorrow from Reiko. You think you could give her a hug, Sarah? I... Yes! Please! Reiko is gazing at the monitors. AIs, huh? There's one over... There's one here. One of him. He must be an Alice. Do you want to meet him? You want to meet him? No. A machine is just a machine. The real him is still in the room of lies. He goes keeping it all inside. Probably better that I don't see any AI. Because I'm not as strong as now. <laughs> What button do I press to hug Reiko? Please. Monitor is broken. Professor Mishima AI was here. Reiko's AI. Alice's AI. Gin's AI. KG's. Kana's. Monitor is broken. That one's very likely so's. Whoop. Turn that off. Let's still go to prize exchange. Dead. Let's go label us and put over Alice's photo. Alice. That's mean. I'm terribly sorry. You may not use the prize exchange anymore. I'm cleaning up the prizes, so apologies if it gets dusty. What do you got? Can't tell anything about Gashu's heart. Is that hardly ever talked to him? Time you spent together is important for this. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh, where's my button to hug Reiko? I really want to hug Reiko right now. Who's here? Eh? Oh, I was hoping we could detective image that. Now! You good? Now we're staring directly at Alice's body. She doesn't seem to notice us at all. Sure enough, she's acting strange. Sarah, not right now. Ugh! Sense pressing emotions from now. There's no time right now, Sarah. Okay. Something's up with now. Reiko is just feeling... Feels bad, Reiko. Medical office. Nothing here. Okay. What can you see in here, detective? Nothing. Well, we're in corridor. There's a booth here. Can you even trade here? Well, let's go into the room of rubble. Again? Sarah Hyde. Huh? Looks like we're not alone. What's Gin doing here? You can hear rummaging sounds in the pitch dark room. Gin? That's Gin. Ah, uh, defer to Keiji. Let's see what happens. Gin is timidly messing with the machine. This is it, meow. Gin? 
What? Oh! A passage appeared! Is this the way out that Gin was looking into earlier? Interesting. See? I can! Gin's just trying to be helpful. Not good, he's going in alone. Uh. Let's tail him. Why did Gin know about this room? If he just happened to find it, that's fine, but... He actually knew something. I heard to suspect the kid, huh? I... Uh... You prepared? Cancel. I mean, I don't really suspect him, but... God, if, it, if we... Tail him, and he's... Okie dokie, but promise me one thing. Huh? On the off chance there's something dangerous waiting up ahead. You'll be able to run away even if it's on your own, won't you? Yes, and you too, KG. <laughs> Roger that. God, I hope I, I hope nothing happens again. Passage is lit by a dim light. Gently slopes downward. The further we advance, the steeper the slope gets. Careful not to slip. It, yeah. Kid, how far did you go? Hmm? It's a dead end. Ah, KG, is this... It's a hole like a trash chute in the floor. Kid must be through here. Let's drop down. What is... What room is this? It looks like the kitchen. Ah, oh, it seems somehow familiar. This is where we came from. To think it would connect to here. Well, air conditioned. Well, now, I remember coming here. If I remember right. This is the first floor kitchen. The place where Nahau was hiding out and holding Professor Mishima's head. It's pitch black. Was now sitting in the dark like this, too? All alone, talking to Mishima's head. Now was despairing. And Kai used that despair. To take the laptop from So. Amazing how she could recover from that. We're all getting stronger, bit by bit. Yeah, but at the same time, just as much potential to fall back into that despair. No, forget it. Hold on a sec. Did no one notice this secret passage? Miley? Maybe Kai? I wonder if Kai noticed the secret passage. Yeah, that's the feeling I'm getting. Huh? Whether he knew it from the start. Only noticed while searching, I don't know. I'm thinking that's the fundamental reason this laptop ended up in the Room of Rubble. Kai came to the third floor and placed the laptop there. He's right, it's possible. <laughs> that's convinced me, personally. Alright, let's go look for Gin. Oh, boy. Uh, nothing to see here. Cafeteria. Gin? Where you at, son? I mean... I don't know why that... Wow. We, we're back on the first floor. We're back on the first floor. What? Here's this. Locked and won't open. Uh, this door. Was it always locked? No. Taking a closer look at the doorknob, I found a dial and lock on the side. So you have to set it to a number from one to nine. It's KG. Uh, KG, please bust down the door with your brute strength like usual. Eh? Don't think that's in my wheelhouse. These arms are for protected people, see? Sure enough, I, could sh I should consider how to solve this. I wonder if there's a hint anywhere. Well, detective vision. Oh, we can still go in here. What? Something on the bookshelf. Contained victim disc F. Victim disc found on one F. That's interesting. Uh, we can't get into the pink room. So obviously we need to go back there. Yeah, here we are. Holy shit. What? Uh, I th 
Anyway, this is... <laughs> I don't like this one bit. What? What's up, Sarah? Oh, it's nothing. Fine, I... I don't like this at all. Too dark to see. Maybe I can be used. Okay, activate. List of names. Can't drink. Alice Kai, Kazmi, KG Shinsuke. So, now Michi Mai, making me Reiko Kataro. Can't drink. Anzu Kana Gin, Kugie, Sarah, Joe, Nao, Hinaka, Ranmaru. Could these be the names of all the participants in the death game? Huh, now that I think about it, this could be pretty important info. I want to commit it to memory. Yeah, but there are people waiting for him to come back. Right, this isn't just our tragedy. Well, at any rate, we should be able to open the pink room with this info. Don't know if Gin's there, but want to go check? This room. I can feel they make out some erased words. Abandon yourself. Huh? Empty shredder. Interesting. Presumably. Okay, central. Oh, I don't really want to go back here yet. Game room. Thing to be had here. Blue room. Oh, hi, Joe. What is this? Make some disc E. Shouldn't look at them. Uh, hallucinations are back, somewhat. Room. Red room. Red room is tightly shut and can't be opened. Okay. Central hall. Uh. Yeah, we're done here. We can go back there to get names once we actually look at the. Uh, Thing be found there. Small writing under the doorknob. Put the number of kiddos who can't drink. Ha. Huh. Huh. Is this a hint? It's a little sarcastic. I think I can solve the dial riddle now. Actually, I can't because I forgot. The number of kiddos who can't drink. Kiddos who can't drink. Detect a vision! Activate. Can't drink. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine kids can't drink. Okay. Am I singing just to you, uh. alleviate the impending stress of, uh. All of this, yes. We saved. Attempt the dialogue. Let's try that. Hold on, Sarah. There are little holes on the knob. Holes? They might pop out poison needles. Uh, and then I can't get this wrong. Sure there's no hint somewhere in this room? You should know what's up before you try. Even though it was open the first time. Attempt the dialogue. Well, let's see what happens when you get it wrong, first and foremost. About four? Ah, how? Sarah? Ah, I got it 
wrong. What? Hang in there, Sarah. His senses are getting hazy. Ugh, maybe there's an antidote in the medical office. What do you mean so far? This is what does be in. Don't die! KG, I'm sorry. Please, save everyone. Keymaster is dead. Oh, wait, no. Bad. I wanted to continue. Okay. Jump the dialogue. Alright, let's do this. Attempt the dialogue. Handle turns with a click and the door opens. Looks like that was right. Way to go, Sarah. Now we can enter the pink room. Proceed inside. Okay, this is still really... What? Nothing on the shelves. Nothing on the shelves. Heart-shaped vent. The door is open. It's big enough for a person to fit into. Huh. It's pitch black through here. Might need somewhere else entirely. Let's fucking go. Even though in the dangers, eh? Let's go. Well, well, I've never seen this room before. Watch your step. What is this? Things on the desk. It's too dark to see anything. This looks like there's some thing here. It's almost like a person. A person. Just KG reached out his hand. Huh? The lights! This is Miley. K KG, get away! No. Not alive, is it? Huh? What does he mean? It's just a powerless doll. Not moving an inch. You mean... She's not the real one? Wait a second. She called herself the Laughing Doll, Sue Miley. But she must be human. Why'd you figure that? Think back on what's happened so far. Dolls don't bleed. The Doll Ranger proved this fact with his own body. And... Miley bled. When Miley was struck by Kai, she was bleeding. Oh... That's why I figured Miley was probably human. <laughs> Great memory, Sarah. You're exactly right. This doll is probably the Miley we first met. First? After the eleven of us came together. Ah, that, yeah, that's right. We assembled. Our first mission was to search for that scatter... The scatter parts of Miley's body, wasn't it? Come to think of it, we searched for the parts, then assembled her. Then the gas appeared in the room, and then... The full-fledged Miley was there. After a white gas filled the room, Miley suddenly started to move. A white... gas? That's right, the room that filled with gas is connected to this room by ventil by the ventilation. That's when the human Miley swapped herself in. So that's what happened. All starting to line up, isn't it? But this room still hides some interesting truths. Let's keep searching. I wonder if Miley is still on this floor somewhere. Okay, machine parts. Huh, I feel like these are similar materials to our collars. Looks like a refrigerator. Won't open. Uh -huh. Computer disks in the drawer. What are, these? what are these? I'm not really sure. This one has a label on it. 1F security fan camera footage disk. Security camera? Well now, we might have been getting filmed. You don't mean... The whole time. It's not so strange. There's too many of us for just the floor masters to watch over. If you think about it, maybe so, but... I'm curious about the footage. Could we look at the footage? Got you curious, eh? Yes. We can probably view the footage and view the footage of that computer. Can we watch it? What are we gonna see? Behind the thick, thick glass, I can see a figure that appears to be sleeping. KG, there's a person! Hmm, doesn't show any signs of moving. Do they not notice us? Can't imagine it's a survivor at this point. That enemy, let's hope they don't notice us. If 
Now there doesn't seem there's any way we can get to the other side anyway. Let's leave quietly when we're done searching. Yes. Let's save the game again. Hi, Miley. Miley Doll is sitting down. Just chilling. Blowing computer screen. What? There's some video playing. What? Hey! Help me! Please! It's... What? Whoa. I didn't know. I didn't know anything. You're listening there, aren't you? Help me! What's going on over... Th What's going on over there? Can you hear us? Hey! Say something back! I won't tell anyone! I promise! Hmm? Is this a video recording? <sighs> Why? Why is all this necessary? I thought it was decided! She... She? I've got no qualms! I just want to live in peace! Oh. Don't tell me. Were we all gathered for her sake? What? Sarah. Chido. What? what the fuck? What? Damn you! I'll kill you! All you organization members. And Sarah Chidoin. I'll curse your name from hell! Don't look, Sarah! <laughs> uh. Oh! This is probably footage of a person who died in the first trial. Um, I... I have no idea what's going on! This, this video! But, he said your name. I don't know why! Sarah, you might just have an intimate connection to this death game. No way! But, I really... It's no use. The more I say, the more suspicious I look. Just... What am I? Please believe me, KG. How amusing. Um, are you gonna be our goddess of victory? Or our angel of death? Doesn't sound too bad to bet my life on that. Your life? Hmm? That's been my plan for a while now. Can I trust my life to you, Sarah? <sighs> <sighs> <laughs> I understand. I'll take your life in my hands, KG. Now there's the partner I know. What if... What if I am an angel of death? What the fuck is my dad into? And what the fuck is he into that he's got... Every... F all this shit involved. And my name and all this shit. Let's see now. Would you die along with me? Are you... I... I mean, I don't intend to die. That's a good answer. Okay, let's search around a little more. Right. Trust. I've always been a bit suspicious of him. Cage never wants to talk about himself. Ex-detective. Must be a past he can't talk about. A truth he can't say. Even so, Cagey bet on me. Can I? Bet on KG? I... Oh, we're back to this. Oh, God. Put in the disc from the drawer. Computer began loading the video. This is... Well, this... When we all first met up. Sure enough, we were being observed. Hmm. Huh? This video doesn't have sound. Huh? Ah! Joe! Yeah! Eh? Joe? Hmm... Ah, Sarah! <laughs> Sarah? I'm okay. What is it? This video's pretty long. We should probably skip the important parts. Y you're right. Are you prepared? Huh? You can see things you don't like. The other sides of your allies. Well, that's true. What if some distrustful act got the tour recorded? KG is still suspecting that there might be a traitor. <sighs> Will you be okay, KG? You didn't do anything suspect, did you, KG? Uh, <laughs> to 
defiant, aren't you? Let's watch the rest, shall we? Kid, you began to play the rest of the video. Accent at this point played back. Recording from when we were all still alive. We skipped through, checking for anything suspect. And... Sarah. It's okay. Keep it going. You sure are strong. Huh? Guitaro? What? The central hall? Someone placed a card. One of the roll cards were used in the first main game. Who? Who just placed it? Guitaro? Guitaro? And now, someone picked it up. So... Sacrifice. So! Whew, that's some unexpected footage. I think Guitaro was the one who set the roll cards in place. Uh, hold on a second. Think back on earlier. We had a discussion like this before, remember? Who to set up the cards should have been so. So executed a strategy in the bar so he could use Kana. He placed the sacrifice card he had. Had Kana pick it up. He traded her a commoner card to put her in his debt. And then Joe had to pick it. So had Joe pick up that sacrifice card. Well, if it was a trap laid by So, I thought. From what we can see in this video, it's Gutaro who placed the cards first. But if Gutaro placed the sacrifice card there. What the fuck is going on here? We still saw the sacrifice card underneath the desk in the hidden room. Which means this happened first? When did this happen in the timeline of. Kana picking up the card? So just Solomon adopted it. And adopted it, that's all. No way! Well, there's not much video left. I'm trying to sort my head out, I push play. Sure enough, Guitar was so shown again, and again, secretly placing cards. And so picked up a few of those cards. And indeed, made a trade with Kana. It was all true. Some mysteries solved, others added. Keeping my hazy feelings in check, I let the remaining bit of video play. Huh? Are Joe and Kai talking about something? Hmm. Such enigmatic faces. Just what were those two talking one on one about? You never told me anything like this. Oh, I could just hear their voices. Hmm. That's everything of note in this foot in the footage. Sure took up some time. We should leave here soon. You hold on to this disc, Sarah. Okay. Made some findings. Now we search for Gin and work towards escape. <sighs> That's a lot to fucking take in. What the fuck? Can we... use this? Is there the disc I found while exploring? View the disc. Victim E. Watch victim disc key. We to begin loading the video. Ugh. What? Who are you? Damn it. This is awful. Why did this happen to me? Is there someone there? There is, right? Answer me. Am I gonna die? Ah, this sucks ass. Seriously? Sure, my life was pretty boring. I didn't care about the future. But now? Ain't it strange? It doesn't hurt at all. I'm bleeding this much from my gut. Why doesn't it hurt? Does it feel like I'm really dying? Hey, am I still alive? Hey. Video ends here. It's as if he fell asleep at the end. He's probably a high schooler. A human, about the same age as me. Maybe he was one of the happy ones. What am I saying? I just felt a tinge of envy, that's all. People killing each other. Allies dying. Being able to die without having to experience those things is happy. <laughs> I'm thinking idiotic things. For his sake, too, I... Alright. Watch victim disc F. Computer began loading. Help! Whoa, 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 whoa! No, no, no! Why? Why does this have to happen? 
How could I possibly know which one's right? You have to be the baker, right? I can't do it. I can't fire these things. Uh, ow! What? The collar's tightening. Stop it. I can't breathe. Oh, fire. So stop it. Ooh. 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 Ah. Ah. The video ends here. Oh, is this from the first trial, too? Just too cruel. How would you think up such a thing? I thought I knew entirely well that our enemies were practically demons. Even so, being shown this... Can we escape? From demons who make us do things like this? We'll escape them, all right. Our dying regrets. Oh. I sure hope Gin doesn't doubt us after this. So, Singer, let's examine these again. Who's our other high school students? Anzu Kanashi. And Maru Kagayama. One of these has... Was that Renmaro we saw in that first picture? That seems like a boy's name. Oops, I went to... Yeah, one of these was... Monster Baseballer. My Suruki. That, has, that had to be the baker. That was a baker outfit. Uh, Renmaru. That had to be him. Uh, Mishinaku Mishuku. Hinako? Or Anzu had to be Kana's sister. Door shut fast, there's no handle. Probably can't be opened manually. I sure hope Gin doesn't suspect us. Make sure not to kick it. Detective, is there a way to open the door? Let's get out of here then. Where's Gin? Meow! That was Gin! Listen to his voice. Where'd that voice come from? No good, can't hear him anymore. Gin! The situation's changed. Thinking safety-wise, we should probably head back for now. No! You want us to abandon Gin? We refuse to give up! Mm -hmm. You're right. Let's look around, Sarah. No more losing anybody. Right! Okay. Gin? Gin? You're not here. Okay. Are you in the hidden room? No. Take the detective vision. Spot my boy. Where is he? Where is my son? What is this? I think on the table. A key? I was here before, was it? Maybe I shouldn't go touching it. Well, I mean... Let's take it. Where did you get it? Key with tag. Not good. Someone's coming from the central hall. Huh? I don't like these choices. Do any choices. We have to find Gin. We have to find Gin. Sorry, Sarah. Huh? Huh? Yeah! He just picked me up under his arm and moved me into the kitchen. They're close. Keep quiet. Ah, uh, again. Footsteps stop near the door. I see two. One of them is Miley. I can hear them talking quietly. Did you let them escape? I apologize. Hmm? The key that was here is... Gone? Seriously, give it up. Is Gin safe? Who could the other person be? Listen, don't let Gashu have his way. He's trying to destroy the death... Oh, What? I understand. The monitor room should have a surveillance mode, correct? Connect the blue wire and keep a careful eye on Gashu. Wh what do you know about? And one more thing. You must retrieve the chip in Ranger's head. That chip can destroy this place's security. It's a menace. Destroy? The security? <laughs> Please be quiet. What if someone heard you? <laughs> then things would get quite fun, I suppose. Huh? Oh, and... What? The tablet? This is not the time! Who's there? 
have to run. Oh fuck. <laughs> That was a close call. But Gin is still... It didn't look like those two had captured him, at least. Let's think about what we can do. Uh, check our roles. Our priority should be to check our roles. An annoying Earl's noise earlier signaled to trade. All uh, right. Someone's cards must have gotten traded. We just have to look. What do we got? We're still key ma I'm still key master. That's good. Second trade was performed four minutes ago. I am still the key master. And I am still the commoner. This was between people other than us. Kutaro and whom, Tara? Let it in any extra complications. Okay, now about that conversation we overheard. Those two mentioned some very interesting things. Yep, something about a chip in Ranger's head. Plus a surveillance mode in the monitor room. I don't know what sort of functionality it has. But if we could watch the security cameras on all the floors... Sounds loads better than sneaking back onto the first floor and getting caught. Let's go. Holy fuck. That was a lot. Oh my god. Yeah, Detective KT. Oh my god. <laughs> I really hope that Gin's not going to be terribly afraid of us after seeing that uh, video. He probably will. That's unfortunate. I'd love to know what the fuck Sarah's role is in all of this. It's clearly not role, not a role she ever intended on, she ever wanted or desired. It's a role that some people with very cruel intentions seem to be laying out for her. Oh, but we have two leads ahead of us, and we have three, uh, Two leads ahead of us and one pressing need. We need one pressing need, one some somewhat pressing need, and one just desire. Two leads in front of us. Uh, examine the monitors. Find Ranger's head. Those are our two leads. I suppose you could call the third lead the key we have. Then. Three pressing desires. One, find Gin. Two, check up on Now. She's clearly not herself. Three, hug Reiko, because she needs a damn hug. And I demand a button for us to hug Reiko. She needs it. Oh my god. So we're gonna leave off on this. When we return, we're gonna resume. Try to sort some of this shit out. Hopefully before we can even get to the main game. I wasn't expecting more exploration, but this is fucking wild. Goddamn.